Well, first, Scott, you had said uh, at the last game you had a couple of injuries. So how's the squad shaping up for this one? Yeah, we've still got um, a couple of little niggles, to be honest, and we are kind of trying to see um, as much of the squad through um, as we can to the, 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 the next couple of matches. Um, that are obviously, you know, really important. Both both games are, are massive for us, but um, I'm also having to, to to juggle players' fitness to a certain degree, and that's just because the games have come thick and fast. We've picked up a couple of injuries. I think the, the P Mount game took a lot out of the team. Um, so yeah, um, they are coming back, and um, we're getting stronger again uh, in terms of how many players we've got fit. So, yeah, I'm trying as best as I can to, to, to balance that over the next couple of games. There's two really important games coming up now. Uh, Hibs on Sunday and then Valour in the Champions League on Wednesday. How do you balance the, the, those, the, the importance of those two games? Yeah, it's tricky. It is tricky. You, you kind of really just have to take it one game at a time, which, um, you know, obviously in the background... The coaching staff are, are working hard at uh, preparing for both games. But as as a coach, it's um, it's important that the players remain focused on the next game that's coming uh, and not get too uh, mixed up in terms of what what the game plans are. And um, I think we focused completely um, on on Hibs, and uh, we won't we won't look at Valour until the Hibs game is over. Uh, of course, that means we, we as a staff have to be prepared that we can quickly show the players what we need to show them on, on Valour. And um, I think uh, the players that we've got, you know, we've got a lot of experience in, in the squad and they're used to, to doing this. They're used to having, you know, a tough league match followed quickly by a, a flight and, um, you know, the prep being as condensed as it will be for the Valour game. And, you know, sometimes that can work for you and sometimes it works against you. You know, it can bring a freshness because you're just, you know, coming off the back of one game and then you're right into the, the, the next game. And, um, yeah, I, I'm not going to have to to do too much to get the players motivated for, for either of these matches. And then, uh, Hayley, if you don't mind, what... A as, as we've said, Glasgow City and Hibs have had such a great rivalry these last few seasons. What is it that makes the Hibs game so special? Um, it's two good teams, really. I think that's what it's always been. It's been uh, two good teams that are, that are fighting for the Cups and for the league. Um, yeah, it is a good rivalry and I think it will remain that this season. It's an important game for us as much as it's an important game for them. And um, But yeah, we're wanting to get the three points and and put us in good stead going forward. How important then is it to, to keep this win and run going, especially going into the Valour game on Wednesday? Yeah, it is big. Um, obviously, we go into every game wanting to win. Um, we'll be looking for a good performance. And I think, you know, if you get a good performance and on the back of that going into Champions League, you, you're going in with some confidence. Um, but it, it's a tough week for us. Um, two, two big games, but we're really looking forward to it.